Hi, I'm Beth Level. I'm playing Mrs. June Adams in the new Broadway musical, Bandstand. And I'm here to play Roll Call. Mm. All of the above. No, hold please. Dance and Queen, Rake Stage, ABBA, lots of dancing, and I was perpetually tan. Kick my ass, but I was a superstar. I was a rock star in this one. That was a lot. That was fun. Dee Dee Allen, The Prom. It was at the Alliance Theater in Atlanta, and hopefully it's coming to Broadway soon, and I played this diva Broadway star, Dee Dee Allen, who represents my evil twin, and I felt like a big star in this one. Yes! Beatrice Stockwell and the Drowsy Chaperone. I feel like I gave birth to this one successfully. It's really, really fun. I'm very proud of it. Oh, <laughs> Minsky's. Charles Strauss, Susan Birkenhead, Casey Nicola. It was in Los Angeles, and I had some of the greatest tunes ever, and not that many people saw it. Probably this, because it's too many words. <laughs> and I had a great time doing it, but it takes up, you know, they go, you have 10 words, and this is seven. If you'd called it like standing, then I could put it in my bio. Or gay marriage, I could put it in my bio, but no, it's all that. That's right, come here. Come to Mama. Okay? Anytime Annie, one of the, uh, the original 42nd Street back in the 80s. I did the show for four years and I could still do that tap break like it was 1987. Go into your dance. I'm out. Believe it or not, it was Florence Greenberg, Baby It's You, because I fell in love with this man that found me incredibly attractive on stage and in the story, and I felt like a million bucks. I had 25 costume changes. All of them were couture-like, and I felt beautiful and sexy, and I felt like everybody wanted me. Big role, and I did it at the Muni, which meant I had 10 days of rehearsal. You know, I had done my homework, and I had done it before, twice. It's a huge mamma jamma role, and it scared the hell out of me, and I, I loved it, which made it even more thrilling once you got through it and successfully told this story. But yeah, it was something. Mrs. Bixby in the Civil War, because I was actually in a beautiful black morning dress that was uh, accurate to the, the era, and I had this beautiful, gorgeous wig, and I felt so in character with this hair. It's one of those things you put it on, it's like, now I get to sing a sad song. <laughs> but I look pretty. <laughs> the role that's close to my heart is Mrs. June Adams, who I'm playing now in Bandstand, because A, I get to play a mom, and I'm a mom, and I always like accessing that emotion. B, because I base the entire character on my mother, Ruby Level. So she's my inspiration for the role, and I, when I put on her wig and her clothes, June's clothes, I feel like I have turned into my mom. What was so amazing is when you walk into the room and you, you see all of that, it kind of took my breath away. It's a little overwhelming and really special, and I'd like to keep all of them and make a quilt. So whenever I feel down or unemployed, I'll just pull them all around me and go, yeah, yeah, you're a working actor. Speaking of that, please come see Bandstand. We open April 26th, we're in previews now. It's a wonderful show at the Jacobs Theater. Bandstand, an American musical. Thank you, Roll Call. <laughs>